All right. Welcome to my shiny hunting with Toad. This is going to be episode one. I have figured out a way to record my DS using three simple things. My phone as a camera, a glass cup to prop it up, and so I can see through it. That's why it's glass. And a book to keep everything flat on. And then, of course, my DS to play on. It's pretty great. I'd say it works decent. The quality is watchable. It actually doesn't look too bad for a 3DS game either. And I can look through the game. Oh, see. The only negative side to this is I have to play with my index fingers. I mean, I can try to use my thumb. But then the system starts to move, so it's easier to just use my index finger. Double ring! Ah, oh, couldn't get through it. Because there's a tiny delay on what I'm watching because it's through a glass cup onto a phone screen. So you can imagine it looks somewhat odd. But I can manage to play. Ah, oh, I went into the blue one. And I finally figured out a solution to make the lighting work. So when it turns black, it doesn't like show everything in my room. And that was just to turn the lights in my room off, which is great. That is a Quagsire. The only downside is I cannot press the run button very easily. Like you'll see right now, I'll try to press it and you probably see my finger. Ha, ah, I got it. So that's great. Still kind of working. How to play with my thumbs, because I would much prefer to play with my thumbs. Maybe if I... Probably won't see anything for a sec. Maybe if I do this... Maybe if I do this... Do this, I can hold the screen. If I like grab the book and... Do something like this. This works. No, this doesn't work. I'll just go back to using my next finger. But this is nice. And this is like super relaxing to do, so I can just kind of talk while doing this. But yeah, it's shiny hunting. Basically in Pokemon Ultra Sun, if you do this and you go through a double ring, which is like two little rings around a portal. You'll probably see one with one ring here in a second. Like that. There are two rings. Then it's a 7% chance to find a shiny Pokemon. And I might as well clean up the rest of the legendaries I haven't caught. Which is like four or five. Except I might shiny hunt Latios. So I don't know. If I find Latios I might just run away. Or not encounter it. Just because I might want a shiny one of that. Which is a whole different way to get it. And I'm really running low on speed here, so I better focus. Alright, there's a double ring. Alright, I got into it. So this gives us the best chance to get a shiny Pokemon. And alright, I'm gonna save really quick. I have to like memorize where the buttons are. Alright, I saved the game. And you can't really see the bottom screen, but... I don't know how I'll fix that. What's this Pokemon? Okay, it's a Sigly something. I don't know how to pronounce it. And is that? Is that? Haha! <laughs> it's a shiny. What are the odds? Well then. We already found our shiny of the episode. I'll make sure to catch this guy. So let's just Ultra Ball because I have Rush Ram out. It'll knock it out in one hit. So I can't really damage it. So don't get all mad at me in the comments that this is how I'm choosing to do it. Three. Come on. Aw. Oh, it tricked us. Alright, you're gonna raise your defense. That's fine. Alright, let's go again. Throw another Ultra Ball. 
Maybe it'll stay in this time. One. Two. Three. Oh, man, it got out again. Last second. Okay, use Sky Attack. Alright, use another Ultra Ball. I got tons of them. I got like 80 of them, so it's fine. Ooh, he broke out instantly this time. Ouch. He does good damage. But alright. So I guess I don't really know how many of these episodes. It might just be till I catch a shiny. Something like that. This guy's being a little rascal. Alright. Yeah, he's just flooding his defense up. Which doesn't really help him stay out of this Pokeball. I should be able to catch him soon. Nope. He broke out again. Okay, he used Sky Attack again. I would really prefer that. He stays in this time, so I'm Rush Ram doesn't take too much damage. No! Wow. This guy's tougher than all of the other ones I've had to catch. I think I have seven now. I think this is, I think this is my seventh. Which is pretty nice. So there's one. There's two. There's three. Ah, we got him. Alright, well, there is a shiny Sigaleaf. I think that's how you pronounce it. Hopefully it is. And no, we will not nickname him. I think it's a him. I don't know. There we go. Now let's go back to the Pokemon Center and see what we caught. And I won't actually be able to cut any of this out because I'm miraculously somehow recording this on my phone. So this is as good as we're going to get. So, all right, I'm just going to use my Charizard Glide right here. And this is where I want to fly. So let's do that real quick. As you can see, we got our trusty little Charizard there. Take us to the Pokemon Center. And thanks Charizard, we're here. So let's walk inside. First, let's give all our Pokemon a good heal. Which we'll do right now. So there's my six Pokemon. Moltres, Ho-Oh, and those four. Uh... I don't remember the name of them right now. Oh, turn that way. There we go. Hopefully it shows. I think it won't show my Pokemon. So where is it? It's right here. Alright, so we're going to go to Summary, and it should show the IVs on the top. It's, it's pretty rounded. Nothing too special anywhere. Alright. That's that. It has Air Slash, Psychic, Cosmic Power, and Sky Attack. The ability is Wonder Skin, if anybody wants to know about that. And there are the IVs. So, alright. Well, I guess I can't really show all my Pokemon, but I can just kind of scroll through. I got that yesterday, which is pretty cool. I got some of those. We'll have to move them all. What's that? Alright. So, that has been... Shiny hunting episode one. I don't know. This is this is pretty fun. I'll totally have to do more later. But there we go. And if you guys think that this is watchable, hit that like button. If you have any ideas how I can record it better, tell me. And I'll see y'all later. Peace.